Hi, this is Mike with RPS Solar Pumps, and I want to tell you about our premium line of solar fountain pumps. These are great for your ponds and lakes. It's going to keep your lake aerated and keep the plants and fish happy. You can also use it for pier aesthetics. We have two different fountain heads you can choose from. I'm going to show you those in a couple of minutes. This is a great addition to any pond or lake you have, and it all runs off of solar. So the great news is no electricity bill, no ongoing maintenance. You plug it in, get it running, and as soon as that sun comes up, you're gonna have your solar fountain pump pumping all day long, putting oxygen into your lake, and a very nice look. We're gonna go ahead, I'm gonna give you an overview of all the components that come with the kit, and then we're gonna go install one in the lake you see right back behind me. So let's go over the components that you're gonna get with the solar powered fountain pump. So here is our submersible pump. This is gonna hang right below our float out in the middle of the pond or lake. This goes through the float using a nipple, and it goes to a fountain head. Now, you have two options of fountain head. Uh, you can pick either one. The one on my left here, it has a jet out the top. It goes a little bit taller. The one on the right here is more like a shower head. It sprays out in all different directions. Uh, we're gonna show you one of these today, um, and we have pictures of what the other one looks like. We're gonna get our controller. So our controller is gonna take the power from the solar panels, and it's gonna drive our pump. Basically, when the sun rises, it's gonna start up a little slow and you're gonna have a little fountain there. And then as the sun gets fully in the sky, it'll go up to full stream. And then during the evening, it's gonna fade off and it's gonna do that every day that the sun is shining, keeping oxygen in your lake or for that aesthetic appeal while you're out sitting over looking at the lake or fishing in it. It also comes with our solar panels. We have two different kit sizes. One is called the F400. That's gonna come with this pump here and four solar panels. We also have the F 750. Now that's a three quarter horsepower pro series pump. That is going to produce quite a bit more water and so you're going to pick the model depending on how much flow you want, how much oxygen you want into your lake. Partially depends on the size of your lake. It also depends on just how large of a fountain you want out of the middle of your pond or lake. There's a couple of items that you're going to need to purchase separately. One is wire depending on the exact length of your installation. For today we're using about 200 feet because from where our solar panels are going to be mounted, it's about 200 feet out to the center of the lake. You're also going to need to get a weight and a rope in order to hold the pump where you want it in place. Uh, we're going to use a cinder block and a piece of poly rope today. Nothing special for that. You could use uh, stainless steel wire, chain, or anything else you want to use in order to weight the pump down so it doesn't drift around. And that's about it. Once you have your solar panels mounted, it's a very simple installation. We're going to hook up our controller, we're going to hook our pump to our controller, and assemble our float to our pump here. And then we have a kayak down there. We're going to kayak out to the center of the lake, drop it all in there, and turn it on. Let's go ahead and start assembling our float and our pump and our fountain head. Today we're gonna to go with our cluster type fountain head, which is here in my right hand. Uh, this is also the blossom. We decided not to use the blossom today. Uh, the person here wants to use uh, the cluster head. So it's gonna take about three or four minutes to get this installed. Follow along and uh, you'll see it's a really quick process in order to get this hooked up. Uh, you're gonna to wanna to use uh, Teflon pipe tape just to make sure there's not any major leaks. Obviously, we're in the middle of a pond. It doesn't matter if we have a few drips coming out, so we don't have to worry about the tightness of all of these joints. I'm gonna tape them up anyways and uh, get this pump and float and set up real quick. So we have our solar panels installed using our top of pole tilt mount. Now this mount is great because it allows us to change the angle of our panel by only loosening four bolts and we can adjust it for winter, summer, or just maintain a year round average angle to produce the most amount of fountain and water for your pond. We have our pump and our float assembled with our fountain head on top. Again, this is the cluster head. We also have the blossom, which we're not using today. We have our rope attached and a cinder block behind me. Now we're gonna go ahead and install this out in the pond. I'm gonna carry it on down, jump on our kayak, and pedal out right over to the center of that pond and drop it down. We're about two feet low right now, so we're gonna leave two feet of extra slack in our rope in order to account for the seasonal variations in the water. Let's go ahead and get this installed.
see we've got our fountain fired up and it's out there in the distance operating. So that's running off of four solar panels. It's about six feet tall and doing around 15 gallons a minute. If you're going to have a bigger pond, you might want to go up a size or if you have a smaller pond, you can go down a size. It depends on your aesthetics and the amount of aeration you need. For this pond out here, that's the right size to give great aeration. It's going to help with the plant life. It's going to help with the fish life. It's going to keep this pond nice and healthy. Plus, we're out here on a golf course, so it's going to look great for the golfers who are going around and teeing off around us. This is Mike with RPS Solar Pumps. If you need a fountain pump, give us a call at 888-637-4493 or visit us at rpssolarpumps.com. We'll help you size it, we'll help you with aeration needs and oxygen loads in your pond. Give us a call and we'll get you set up with a fountain pump today.